everybody. Uh, Friday the 13th, uh, current time, 6.37 in the morning. 6.38, just uh, to be punctual, or at least, you know, really cutting some, uh, some fine straws there. Anyhow, I wanted to let people know I'm doing all right. Yes, uh, about all this post the past few weeks. Uh, I don't know who's kind of aware. My uncles are being evicted from the uh, house I'm staying at. You know, I'm staying with my friends, so my friends are kicking them out. Uh, it's a, just a long, drawn out, involved story. You know, that's that's how family goes. Uh, but that's been putting a lot of strain on me lately, so I apologize if my posts have been bothering people. But I felt I felt it was time to actually put a you know a little video doc on it instead of just typing a post. I want people to actually kind of kind of see. You know, and, and, uh, how do I put it? If you can perceive the uh, stress, or if you can perceive the energy drain, uh, and, and, you know, everything that I'm dealing with, you're not going to be able to see it in the video, but if you've known me long enough, you, you know me pretty well. And, uh, just a couple weeks ago, I was going out with some friends, or was it last week? Yeah, last Friday. Um, only a few of us, but you know. That's pretty much like the, uh, the extent of my social involvement right now. Uh, mostly because the uncle was at the house. Uh, a few other things going on too. But, you know, I'm just hanging in there. Uh, <laughs> the ladies, yes. Uh, let's, let's try and avoid that one, shall we? Uh, my luck. Let's just, let's just put it straight up. My luck fucking sucks. No two ways about it. Uh, that isn't to say I have problems approaching. It's just the way I'm coming across is it's just not working for me. Mostly because of where I'm at in life. And um, yeah, well, honestly. I don't know how many people out there really, truly can say this without lying through their teeth. Um, but the wheelchair, the crutches, the disability, it's got a little bit to do with it. And usually it's just a big initial hurdle to get over. I'm not worried about that, but honestly, I do. Uh, they want to take me for my money. I'm not down. Uh, yeah, that's some childish shit, and that's just not cool. So, yes, having my morning coffee, as you can see. Uh, so yeah, a couple of my buddies have been joking for years about going to set me up on a date. And I was like, alright, well, if you're gonna do it, do it. Not going to, uh, divulge identities or nothing like that, because, well... That's just, that's just how it goes. That's just how it goes. Um, Pathfinder Rough Training. Yes, I signed up for Pathfinder Forward here. Beginning of the month, it starts November 1st. 12 weeks. Uh, I'm looking at about doing 150 miles in that 12 weeks. Uh, I'm not going to lie. I don't really have anybody out here that likes to do rough training very much. And I kind of need that uh, fire under my ass. I need to boot up my ass get me out moving. Uh, mostly because it's, it's the getting out moving, no problem. Once I start moving, my pain sets in. I get fatigued. I need that go, go, go motivator, you know. I need that bootstraps. I need that fire under my ass. And I won't lie to you and say, that, oh, yeah, uh, I can do that all day long. No, um, there are days... That day I did 11 miles in a couple hours. I had no fucking idea. It was just one of those days, hey, I got an appointment, gonna go to the appointment, I, was, I showed up early, well, okay, I showed up early, I'm gonna kill some time.
time before I knew it, by the time I got back, I had already cracked out nine miles, and then later that evening, my buddy wanted to go out and ingress. No big deal. I'm cool with that. Did not expect it to be over 12. Uh, 11, 11.31 miles. Yes, I, I kind of get asked and I move my numbers. I'm sorry. Um, so, yeah. Anybody wants to do rough training, hit me up. I'm serious. Uh, I'm looking at maybe, you know, five miles a day. That's all I'm looking at doing. Five miles a day. Do my wad. You know, I, and I still need to tuck the course advisors and whatnot, but I'm going to do my wad. We're going to go there and see how that works out. Uh, they were totally supportive of it. Saying, yeah, dude, uh, we think you totally can do this. So, sign up. So I said, fuck it. Signed up. And now, uh, we're, you know, chomping at the bit. Got 14 days, you know, uh, actually, I'm sorry, 17 days to go. And we'll see how it goes. But I would have greatly appreciated it if uh, somebody local, at least, for the love of God, uh, would like to accompany maybe on one or two roads. Uh, just, I just go around town. I don't do nothing fucking crazy. Um, but it is a lot easier, let me tell you. When you've got at least one other person right there embracing the suck with you. Um, it's a real gut check, you know. Get out and, and go at yourself. You have to hold your accountability. You've got to be accountable for yourself. You, you can't short yourself. You can't cut corners. It's either you do or you don't. And personally, I'm not going to be the kind of person that spend 25 bucks on a training program and not do it. Uh, I have a penchant in the past for, you know, dropping things not long after I start them. Uh, I've been playing Ingress for almost five years now. Some of the other things I've done in life, they, uh, they haven't found out. That's not necessarily me shirking duties or what have you. But, uh, I don't know, you live, you learn, right? Uh, San Francisco, Ingress X05, my game plan so far, I'm looking, I'm essentially probably going to be only sleeping after the after party, uh, if I'm going to be doing the go ruts, uh, I probably only have about three hours in between of that, so, I'm looking at showing up on the first, and just cracking it out, sometime evening of the second after we're all drunk up go find somewhere to crash go do mission day and then uh, fly home so I can do the flight that shouldn't be a problem but you know we got about a month and a half uh, I'm still waiting on details for where all this shit's going to be and I really have a hard time trying to figure out Okay, if, what, I need to know exactly where it's going to be so I can plan where I'm staying. Uh, obviously, if I'm flying, I'm flying to San Francisco, no way around it. But, let me think here. So, I may only need room for one night. That's no big deal. Uh, I'm still going to need to find, uh, you know, figure out my, my way around Bart. It's been a while since I've been back up to the bay. Um... So, while I don't need much money, and I know a lot of people want me to do this anomaly because I haven't done an anomaly since Age of Nova last year, um, I don't want to put up a GoFundMe, uh, because I, I've had a lot going on, I've got a lot of personal things going on, um, and I'll, I'll just, I'll briefly summarize it, uh, we've got some things going on in the family where, uh, we're probably going to have to create our own GoFundMe and do that stuff. And you know, with all the all the natural disasters going on, I mean, I just I don't feel right asking for money. If that makes sense. Um, yeah, and I know everybody has always heard this from me. I don't like taking money. And I, I'm still living up, uh, you know, the wheels thing. I, mean, you know, I got to buy wheels, but yeah, now, but ever since Wheels to Max got finished, uh, yeah, I, I still have issues with taking assistance from people. 
and it's not to say that I'm like really financially hurting, but you know, living on disability is not easy. Um, to those who, who can do it and still manage to save money at the end of the month, hey, more if I can talk to you, please tell me how you do it. Uh, but no, seriously, I didn't want to put a rope on me for it, but I've already had a, a few number, you know, a fair number of people twist my arm. I've just been lagging on putting it up, uh, mostly because I, I've got to swallow that bitter pill. Uh, I don't want to do it, but my friends want me there. I, I still have people that, that live, you know, in the other half of the state I haven't had, and we've been playing the same game for, you know, four and a half, four and a half five years. So, uh, yeah, it's about time. Uh, so, if anybody up in the Bay sees this, whether you're, uh, whether you're GRT, whether you're resistance, uh, or enlightened even, because, uh, hey, I'm, I'm cross back. You know, I'm not going to, I'm not going to go, well, you're green. So, uh, you know what, it doesn't matter. If, if, if the help's out there and it's going to be offered, I'll take it. Uh, the first step to get the help is to ask for it. And I, that's that's my that's my hang-up. Uh, I, I need to ask you for help. It's that uh, that independent nature of me. You know, I've always been taught to just do it yourself. If you can't do it yourself, don't do it. And uh, I need to really change that line of thought. But uh, yeah, that's just kind of like a brief ramble. You know, roughly 12 minutes from me running my mouth and giving you a quick verbal diarrhea version of what's going on in the life. Um, I, I want to thank everybody for kind of you know sticking through all the uh, all my drama lately. Uh, thank you for being understanding. If I'm not replying back to you quickly or not at all, even um, if I see distant, disconnected, hey, I'm getting your messages, if, if you've known me for a fairly long time, and you've dealt with, uh, with my anxiety, my depression, my, my swings, if you will, um, and you already know that's part of me, and you, you kind of already know that, hey, uh, you know, I'm receptive, I'm getting news, uh, if I don't get a hold of you outright, or if I... If I seem to be distant when I'm talking to you, it's nothing personal. Uh, I've got, got a lot on the plate and not enough brain to process how much shit I have to move. So, anyhow, I would I just wanted to you know bring everybody up to speed, tell them where I'm at. Uh, once again, uh, you know the people that have been helping me through uh, do some of this shit lately. Uh, you know who you are. I, I'm not gonna. I'm not going to publicly name names, mostly because it's a, that's personal, you know, um, people people I know that know some of my more personal friends, uh, hey, that's that's cool, uh, but I don't need some random people going, oh, so who's this person you're talking about? You know, they have absolutely no clue who, who I associate with, and it's not a bad thing, but... I have the tendency to find the people in life that make the biggest piles of fucking horse shit out of a goddamn molehill for no reason at all. And that's. Oh, and I'm guilty of it too at times. You know, I make the biggest things out of the smallest things a lot. And it's something I have to change. But, uh, oh, cool. All the lights went off. Cool. Not funny about that. It's hugs. I pressure sitting. Whatever. Fucking lights they use. But, uh, yeah, thanks for you know, hanging in. Uh, you know, keeping the faith. Not throwing the towel in on me, you know. Thanks for not talking shit or you know, not being demeaning. I got friends, hey, the sarcasm, I'm cool with the sarcasm, you know. Uh, but you, if you know me well, there are days that I don't find the sarcasm very well, but hey, I'll take it one day at a time. But, uh, yeah, I think I've rambled on long enough. I probably would have to do shit, so just wanted to bring everybody up to speed. Let everybody know I'm doing okay. Kind of give everybody a game plan of what I'm planning to do. Um, and I know we're all busy people out there. Well, at least most of us. Those of us that work in the world, so uh, have the house to maintain or what have you. Um, 
I know we're all busy folks. I don't really pop in and uh, check in with people because I don't like bothering people who are busy. And I don't know people's schedules that well anymore, so... If I if I pop in randomly at some random godforsaken hour, don't hold it against me. Uh, I, I've been a really bad night owl lately. Um, today I fortunately woke up, you know, five in the morning, so uh, that's why I'm up so early. But uh, outside of that, uh, like I said, if I get a hold of you god awful hour in the morning, my apologies, uh, first off. But don't, you know, don't hold it against me. But this is why you don't normally hear from me. I, I know a lot of people have their own things going on, and I tend to, I tend to put myself in the backseat. So, anyhow, 16 minutes of this shit. Uh, I'm tired of hearing myself talk. My hands getting tired, locking, holding the phone. And the sun's getting up. Bob's probably getting ready to head to work, so I should probably head back to the house and keep my eye on 13 days left till the uncles are gone, and uh, they're definitely taking their time with it. And it's just us, so off I go before the noise starts. Alright, thank you much, everybody. Have a good one, and uh, you're not a goal to make me too. Be in touch. Peace.